We just had an earthquake. A sports blogger recording just as an earthquake hits, the second largest in Oklahoma history. Good evening, I'm Karen Larson. And I'm Russ McCaskey. Thanks for joining us tonight. Question is, did you feel it? One of the largest earthquakes to hit Oklahoma struck this morning. Now take a look at the seismograph that I have behind me here. Until 9.06.30, things were pretty calm. And then for the next 30 seconds, there was a whole lot of ground shaken in Oklahoma. And then by 9.07, things started to taper off. Two News reporter Casey Robach joins us live in downtown Tulsa. And Casey, people are still talking about this tonight. They sure are, Russ. Well, this is the first time most Tulsans had ever felt an earthquake, and it took a little while for some people to realize what they'd experienced. For some, it was subtle. About a minute or two afterwards, I kind of, it really kind of hit me that I think that was a, you know, I thought that was an earthquake that happened. While others had no doubt. Kansas State playing. Um... We just had an earthquake. We just had an earthquake. Everyone is talking about Wednesday morning's earthquake. Uh, scary and weird. Main topic of conversation for everyone, for sure. The Tremors epicenter was just east of Norman, but this map from the U.S. Geological Survey shows it was felt all the way from Wichita to Dallas. Amy Gibson with the Oklahoma Geological Survey Observatory says while the number of quakes in the Sooner State is on the rise, with 215 just last month, she says Wednesday's tremor is no cause for concern. I don't think it's the precursor to anything big. I, I really don't. And I, you know, that's just my guesstimate. If somebody thinks that they can predict an earthquake, they're not going to do it. But it does make for some interesting conversation among Green Country residents who can now officially say they've experienced an earthquake. Kind of strange being in Oklahoma and thinking about an earthquake. So. We thought for sure there weren't earthquakes around here, but I guess there are. <laughs> Now, ODOT and the Turnpike Authority say the tremor was so minor here in Tulsa that there is really no need to inspect the roads and bridges. But there are some inspections going on tonight around the Oklahoma City metro area. Live near downtown, Casey Roebuck, 2 News works for you. Casey, thanks. Now, at least two people reported injuries caused by the tremor. Authorities say they were taken to a Norman hospital with minor injuries. One man yeah. fell off a ladder. Paramedics didn't have details on the woman's injuries. Well, so far, there's only minor damage that's been reported. There have been 34 earthquakes reported just this month in Oklahoma. Obviously, most all of those very, very small. And that has some wondering about their insurance policies. Now, most insurance agents say that homeowners aren't covered for earthquake damages on their basic policy. Experts say there's a separate deductible. This is a perfect example of why it's important to have proper coverage, and we encourage people to check with your agent and find out if you do have the coverage, and if not, we recommend you get it. And plan ahead. There is a 60-day waiting period. We have several ways that you can protect your home from earthquake damage on our website. And there you can also vote in our non-scientific poll, which natural disaster are you most afraid of in Oklahoma? That's at KJRH.com.